What's up everyone and welcome to the club. In today's video we're drawing Rosalina Cat from Super Mario. Let's begin today's lesson by drawing in the character's right eye. So from the center, we're going to move over towards the right. Let's draw the bottom of the eyelid, come across, and then bend that up towards the outside. Let's go back to the inside. We're going to draw a half oval, going up towards the top of the eye, and then bring that back down on the outside. Now I'm going to add a thick edge along the top of the eyelid. Starting from the inside, go up a little bit higher, and then taper that down towards the side, and we'll fill the top in black. Let's add some lashes along the outside, bend this out and then up, step down and draw that again. Now I want to tuck the pupil and iris on the inside of the eye. So we're going to start up here, draw an oval, going up, come down and just tuck that in towards the bottom. Let's draw a highlight along the top with a circle, going around and then back up. Now in the center of the iris, we're going to draw a small oval going in behind the highlight for the pupil and we'll fill the center of the pupil in black. Now we're gonna line up with the bottom edge of the eye, move over towards the left, draw a curve coming down and up for the nose, step up and draw a short curve across the bridge of the nose. From the nose, we're gonna step down and add a curve for the mouth. Let's come down the middle and then up. And then we'll add in the upper lip, starting in the middle, draw a V, Come down and then out towards the side. Now along the bottom, add a curve coming down and up across the lower lip. Now you want to bring the hair on top of the left side of the head. So from the right eye, we're going to step all the way up toward the top, bend this down, go across, around the nose, and then back down. Let's go back up to the top. We're going to curve the hair going all the way around and then back in towards the bottom point. So we'll go around toward the top on the side, and then bend that in towards the bottom. Let's add the hair along the side. Starting up here, come across the eye, and then out, round at the bottom, go up, and then bend that in. I'm going to add some hair coming across the side. Starting up here, bend this down, and then in, go all the way around the outside, and then tuck that in. Now you want to layer the head in behind the hair. Let's start on the side, come down underneath the mouth, and then tuck that up on the right side. Now we're going to go back up to the top and draw the outside of the head. Let's start right in the middle with a curve, going up and then down. Now from here we're just going to flatten this off across the base of the ear, coming down and out with a straight angled line. Let's go back up to the top. We're just going to curve the top of the ear, going up and then out. Let's round up the tip of the ear and then pull that back in towards the bottom. Now I want to trace the ears along the inside. So we're going to start from the top, just leave an even space gap going around. From the base of the ear, it's going to curve around the head, pull that down towards the side. And I'm just going to curl this out towards the side. Let's bend this down and in towards the side of the head. Now before we finish off the head, I'm going to go back up and finish off the crown. From the inside of the ears, angle this up and then out towards the side. Down and then in. And we'll add one large point in the center, going up in the middle and then back down. In the center of the crown, let's add a circle. Now, along the side of the head, there's two star shaped earrings. Let's start up here, and let's down and out toward the left and right. And we're just going to go over towards the right and do the same thing. Let's add two points going out the side, go out and back in. And we'll finish this off with one point coming down toward the bottom and then back up. And I want to go back and round out the corners of the head, come around the cheek. 
Let's bend this down and then in just underneath the chin. So we come down on the left, in behind the earring. Continue in between. And go across towards the right. Again, in behind the earring. Then back up. And now we're going to move down and draw on the front arms. Let's start over on the left side. Bend this out and then in towards the wrist. Let's go to the right, blow this out, and then in. Let's round up the base of the arm, going up and then down towards the side. And then from the outside, we're gonna bend the arm going up, and then tuck that up and in underneath the head. Let's add a thick cuff around the wrist. So from these two points, I'm just gonna add a bracket. Close out the bottom with another curve. Now let's add the paws underneath. On the inside of the cuff, I'm just gonna bend this in towards the middle, come around and then back up on the outside. Let's go to the right, I'm just gonna touch the paws on the inside and then hook that back up. Let's add a curve in the center of the paw, then down and then up. And we'll add one more curve coming around the outside and back in towards the outside of the cuff. From these points, we're just going to separate the paws. Starting from the inside, going up and in. Add one more on the outside. Now we want to tuck the legs in behind the body. Let's start from the side. It's going to add the thigh. Going out and bend that in towards the bottom of the cuff. From the side of the front paws, let's separate the first toe, going out and bending that in. Go to the side, draw the outside paw going in underneath the leg. And now we're going to add the tail coming out from the right side. Let's start from the top of the leg, bend this out, and then up around the earring. Bend that back out towards the end. Now it's going to round out the tail, and it'll follow that same curve coming back in towards the side. Now we're just gonna separate the end of the tail with a curve. And then I'll sign my art and add a splash of color. And that's pretty much it. That's how I draw Rosalina Cat from Super Mario. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. If you did, please make sure you subscribe because I'm posting new lessons every single day. I wanna thank you for watching and I'll see you again soon. We've got some exciting news to share with all of you. We're offering a variety of incredible options to level up your art skills. Join our exclusive masterclass memberships for just $1 a month or catch more free tutorials on our Excel sketch channel every week. Don't miss out on any of these amazing opportunities. So subscribe or join today.